Hi guys, welcome to this review of Pretty Zombie Cosmetics. They are a um, liquid lipstick uh, company from the United States. I think they're based in Florida. Um, I saw them first on Instagram. I can't remember where, someone probably posted a link to them or something like that. And I thought they looked really good. They're really similar to the Lime Crime lipsticks, but they are much, much cheaper. Um, especially for us in the UK who have to pay all the import and the shipping they just become ridiculously expensive for something that you can get much cheaper in other places so I decided to take the plunge and buy some I bought them um, for $12 each and then the shipping to the UK is $11 in my sort of money that works out at $7.50 per lipstick um, or liquid lipstick um, which is what I'd pay um, in the in a in a makeup store anyway, so I wasn't too worried about that. And the seven dollars shipping, I bought um, seven pound shipping even. I bought two, so three fifty. You know, takes them up to ten ten pound about, which is a fine amount of money comparing it to Mac or something like that. So they're really. Um, good value for money I think um, for the product that you get. A little more about the company is that they are vegan and cruelty free so you don't need to worry about that sort of um, side of the business if you do. They've got loads of different colours, um, mostly the sort of dark vampy or alternative colours so they've got a couple of really um, vivid purples and they've got blue they've got some great reds in there um, I think they've limited the line down from what they had last year because I've seen some things on YouTube that said they used to have some pinks and things but when I looked on there they had Zombetti which was an orangey red Purple Poison Black Cap Three Witches Potion Number no. 9 <coughs> Vamp, Dahlia and Seawit. Seawit is the blue one. Um, I bought Dahlia, which is an oxblood sort of thing. Their packaging is really cool. So, And there's the zombetti, or the pretty zombie or something. Um, <coughs> oh. <laughs> I've been looking for a, um, a sort of matte oxbloody colour for a long time. And this one just really stood out to me. I won't show you it on my lips because I don't want to take the other one off. But I'll show you on my hands. So they go on wet and they take about 30 seconds to dry to their matte consistency. And you only need one coat. I wore this one to work yesterday and um, I put it on at about 8 o'clock in the morning and then it was still okay. I had to touch it up after my lunch and it did start to bleed around the edge. Um, but you didn't need a lip liner or anything like that. They're super, super pigmented. So it's just drying off. So it's a really great um, maroony oxblood color. And the other one that I bought was Black Cat. And that's the one I'm wearing at the moment. Again, super pigmented. I never thought that I'd wear black lipstick other than at Halloween but I really like the look and um, it's just whether or not I can wear it every day going to the shops and stuff like that but I would have thought that about red lipstick once so why not black? So that's my little um, review of Pretty Zombie Cosmetics. I think I definitely will branch out and get some more of them. Um, Probably not the purples or the blues because they're just not going to suit my um, my complexion. But definitely the Zombetti looks amazing. And then I'll maybe think about Vamp or something like that as well. So head on to their website. I've linked that below. And um, if you do get any, I'd like to know what you think as well. Um, a little bit about the shipping actually because I've seen other people complaining about not complaining but commenting that their shipping is quite slow. It does say on their website if you're in the US then it will take um, I think it was between 3 and 12 working days to process and ship um, from Florida and if you're international it could be between 7 and 20 days 
I ordered mine at the beginning of June. It was about 4th or 5th of June and it, I got these on the 20th of June. Um, so 16 days, it's not that bad. That's pretty much what I thought it would be. So I'm, I'm not shocked by how long it took, but for some people it might be a problem. So all of them were in advance, but you definitely will not be disappointed in the colours that you buy. That's all I have to say. Um, I'm trying to think about what videos to do next. Um, I'm not sure, but if you've got any um, ideas, if you want more makeup or more hair things, um, do get in touch. I'm definitely going to do your beehive one soon. Okay, thanks. Bye.